John Scott joins us now to preview the Governor's Game Boxing Tournament. John, thank you so much for joining us today. Thanks for having me. Of course. Well, tell us a little bit about this. Well, as you know, two weeks ago, Rudy Macklin, who's a representative of the governor, came on and talked about the Governor's Game Tournament, which is sponsored by the governor. And what happens is it's under the initiative of the Governor's Game for fitness and health for our youth. There, he covers a litany of sports throughout the states that he sponsors. You just have to find a location or a city has to request it, and everything is done by the governor. So how does this work for the kids? What it is, whatever particular sport, like we're dealing with boxing. Okay. Sin Law has a boxing team called Sin Law Boxing Team. You join the boxing team. We sponsor the governor's game through Gator this year. Okay. We've been trying to get it for 14 years. Wow. We finally got it. Uh, Drew Gator and some other people that assisted us in getting it. We have a team. Our team will participate in this tournament. You sign up the day, which is Saturday the 24th. You show up at 9 a.m. You register. You sign up. You get matched with somebody at your age, your weight category. That evening, you start competing. Winner takes all. Wow. Mm -hmm. Okay. So I'm sure you need experience to do this. You can't yes. go in there as a, yes. it does say amateur boxing tournament, but yes, you, you want to have, have some experience. experience. Yes, yes. You have, they are, everyone is covered under USA Boxing logo. You have okay. to be a registered boxer with USA Boxing, okay. which covers the United States Olympics trial teams. So once you get registered, we have qualified coaches at the gym where I volunteer at. We teach you how to box. As you learn, you, we determine between you and your parents and ourselves if you want to be a competitor or just an amateur athlete that comes in the gym and work out. How old do you have to be to start uh, boxing? Eight. Eight? The youngest is eight, the oldest is 80, believe it or not. We oh, have really? age range up to 80, but there's categories. Right, so, right, of but course. From, for this tournament, it's gonna be from age eight to 36. Okay, mm -hmm. and so uh, the tournament, can people come and watch that as a spectator? Yes, we're hoping that Senlaw comes out and support this thing Saturday and Sunday. You know, it's gonna be beneficial. You know, we're trying to get everybody to support our kids. Um, Saturday, Saturday is at, it starts at five. Sunday starts at 2. Open to the public. Anybody can come. Bring your mom, your dad, your sister, your grandma, the dog. You can bring them all. You know, we just want to give something back to the community and to give our kids an opportunity that represent Alexandria so that their family can see them saying, hey, that's my son, that's my daughter competing. I'm proud of you whether you win or lose. That's fantastic. Mm -hmm. So where will the tournament be held? It's going to be at the Ale Alexandria Convention Center at, on North MacArthur. Okay. Uh, and like I said, it starts at 5 on Saturday and 2 on Sunday. Okay, fantastic. Mm -hmm. And so people can come as a spectator, mm -hmm. watch it, help support the kids who are in it as well too. If this does ignite a, uh, an interest mm -hmm. in boxing for some mm -hmm. kids who maybe are not already training for it, mm -hmm. what's the best way to get started with that? To get started, you contact me through jjscott1963 okay. at gmail.com okay. or 318-664-2257. We have four qualified, trained boxing coaches who've been in the sport 30 plus years. Wow. Okay, and it's our job to teach you how to box to learn the sport. Once that's settled, we get you registered, and everything else just runs smoothly. Fantastic. Mm -hmm. Are you a boxer yourself? I used to box, yes. Okay, yes. so what got you started into boxing? Actually, I was a troubled kid. I wasn't a bad kid, but I was a troubled kid. I was always fighting. So my aunt said, you know what, you want to fight? Let's go down here to this gym. <laughs> And she put me in boxing, and I've been in it now 51 years. Wow, wow, mm -hmm. and so you help coach as well, too. Yes, coach, train, I'm also a referee. I am the Northern Division Chief of Official for the Northern Division of Louisiana, which means any boxing show that's covered from Alexandria to Shreveport, Natchitoches, West Monroe, I will be the OIC for that, that show. Okay, mm -hmm. so what are some of your favorite aspects of boxing in general as a coach as a boxer i want to see a competitor i just want to see you compete give it your best win or lose you know we live in a society now where people take losing kind of harsh but you know there's something to learn from losing as well you know everybody wants to be a winner but you can also learn from losing and our goal at the gym when we teach these kids just be a competitor. Don't worry about impressing me, Coach Scott, Coach Schmidt, Coach Chuck, or anybody else, or mom and dad. You go in there and do your very best, 
and we're still proud of you regardless. Sounds like a good coaching to me. Yeah. Okay, remind us again what time everything starts this weekend. Saturday, it starts at 5 p.m. Okay. Weigh-ins are from 9 to 11. Okay. Sunday, it starts at 2 p.m. until. Okay, mm -hmm. fantastic. Thank well, you. John, thank you so much for joining us and telling us all about it. Sounds like a great tournament this weekend. Hopefully, we can get the community. Thanks a lot, Natalie. Of course. Okay. We'll be right back with more Good Day Sin Law right after this break.